in a way, I was the guinea pig student because I was the first student in there and the only student to be there Saturday night. Jared Marshall created this TikTok video of his experience. It now has more than 80,000 views. Military style cots, no windows, and... Because they didn't adjust the thermostat for my stay, so it was a little chilly in the gym that night. Jared left after Saturday night. Lucky, he says, his parents found a condo in Jackson. New London town officials are helping the school with logistics. The president reached out to this office last week. Uh, when it became clear that they had this uh, event. Over the weekend, our police and fire departments and um, emergency management director were involved in helping them secure some cots. Becca Lee says she and her boyfriend Jacob were notified Sunday they had to leave their on-campus apartment and move to Hogan, along with their dog, Winnie. Their solution was to put us in the conference room in the gym on two cots. The room has no windows. Mm. It's just four walls and a big table. That was their solution. We showed up. We were the only ones there. The source of the outbreak is not clear. Students admit there is some finger pointing going on. The college declined our request for an interview today. For now, students say all classes are remote. The campus is trying their best. It, the measures seem ridiculous, but they're trying their best. And parents tell News 9 school officials conducted town hall style meetings over the weekend to share information about the outbreak. Live in studio this evening, Amy Cavino, WMUR News 9.